first Indian American vice president. Look, all he said that is that Kamala Harris is a chameleon. She goes to Georgia two days ago. She was raised in Canada. She puts on a fake Southern accent. Donald Trump entered into a very hostile and racist environment when he attended the Black Broadcasting Roundtable. A lot of people did not think it was appropriate for you to be here today. He was quickly tricked by being told that Kamala Harris was also going to attend this event. To his surprise, she did not show up. I've known her a long time indirectly, not directly very much. and. He quickly was faced with a number of very attacking and derogatory questions. These questions didn't focus on gathering more information about him as a candidate, but more so about trying to pin him against the wall and trying to catch him in a verbal mistake. You have pushed false claims about some of your rivals, from Nikki Haley to former President Barack Obama. You've attacked black journalists, calling them a loser, saying the questions that they ask are, quote, stupid and racist. The mainstream media tried to get a few red-hot sound bites and pull them out of context. But in reality, Donald Trump actually fended off this three-on-one attack extremely well. And what ended up happening was he exposed once again the truth about Kamala Harris and Joe Biden. And she was always of Indian heritage and she was only promoting Indian heritage. I'll be the first Indian American vice president in the history of the United States of America, Kamala Harris. And she was only promoting Indian heritage. I didn't know she was black until a number of years ago when she happened to turn black and now she wants to be known as black. So I don't know, is she Indian or is she black? I'll be the first Indian American vice president in the history of the United States of America, Kamala Harris. Kamala is so inspiring is her mother's immigrant story to America that started in India. Now is the time to save America because this could be the biggest battle of our lifetimes.